<laughs> All right, yo, what's up, guys? This is your boy John from Colderice.com, and uh, here we go. The there's there's something happening, and I just want to record it because the uh, I, w I just want to record this right now, so maybe later I can go back and say, "Oops, you were right," or "Oops, you were wrong." So this is kind of like documenting that moment, okay? But uh, the Tribute Machine has started, okay? The Tribute Machine has started. Um, actually, I got my commemorative issue, brand new, the Rolling Stone, you know, uh, Michael Jackson commemorative issue, all right? So that machine, the machine has started, you know? And I'm really watching this. It's, it's very, very interesting. Not only that, of course, you've seen the Pepsi commercial. You've seen, uh, maybe you haven't. Have you heard the, the quick 30-second cut? You need to check it out. They got a new cut from Michael's, you know, uh, unreleased stuff. Now, I'm watching all this. And it could be, you know, because I got, you know, my, my scotch this evening. But I'm still watching this whole thing. And you know how they said um, a long time ago, and you know I've been on this nature kick and business, right? So, so you know how they said uh, uh, when they had the uh, Banda Aceh uh, uh, tidal wave or tsunami, you know they say that the 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 um, tidal the, the the entire you know beach was swept away, and it was you know you could literally see fish, you know just flopping above the water before the actual tidal wave hit or the tsunami hit. And uh, they say that's one of the signs of a tsunami coming is that it sucks back all the energy, all the water gets sucked back and then this huge uh, wave comes over and it takes over everything. Now, I don't know what's happening, but I'm really starting to see this little suck. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling that there is, I'm seeing, I'm, I'm seeing it, and there is something going on now, and I don't think people understand, maybe, and I don't even think I understand this whole thing. This Michael Jackson thing is way bigger than I ever, you know, I mean, I, I'm a fan, I like the music and everything, but it has be, it's, the, the machine is moving, man. But not only is the machine moving, actually a lot of merchandise is about to move as well okay and um, here's the crazy thing is that Michael Jackson was not just America he was worldwide so if a lot of Michael Jackson stuff continues to move can this now move this economy I know I know I know I know I know, I know. it's crazy it's crazy to think that it's that far out, but I will tell you this, that whoever owns Michael Jackson material right now are not necessarily feeling all that pressed about the amount of money that they could actually generate. I mean, the amount of albums that he is selling right now, he's the number one selling artist in the world right now. It's, it's incredible. I mean, that means money is being generated in the music business. Without, I mean, it's, these are catalog albums. People aren't putting out new stuff. This is stuff that's been sitting on the ship. Let me just ask you this, eBayers. I, well, let me just ask you this, e-commerce people, because I'm just thinking this out, and we're talking, all right? But if you actually was sitting on some Michael Jackson stuff that you had no idea, like the, the record companies have been doing, Okay, it's in backlog, it's in library, and all of a sudden this stuff that you've paid for years ago is now generating huge record worldwide income. How would that change your bottom line? That's what's happening right now in the music business, in the entertainment business, even in the magazine business. I just don't, so all I'm saying, let me go back to the beginning, is that I'm just feeling a suck. Is this going to be a tsunami? I don't know, but I do see a few fishes floundering around without water. It's ridiculous, man. I don't know. 
I don't know, call me crazy. Hey, but check it out. In this post right below me, I got a little snippet of the song from Michael Jackson. It, it really sounds good. You should check that real quick snippet out. And then check this out. I, now, I know this really could be the scotch. Let me make sure. But <laughs> we're just having fun. But the deal is is that the, um, they have a LaToya song that's coming out on in, in like a week. LaToya! And, and, and now I really think it's the scotch because I actually think I might like it. So you can check that out below too. This is your boy John from coldrice.com. You know, I'm out of here guys. Peace.